three gunshot victims show up at a local hospital around about the same time. Now police are trying to figure it all out and uh, how they're all connected. Well, K2's Valerie Hurst is live uh, near Vancouver Park where people heard those gunshots. Now police are focusing their investigation right there around you. They are, Natalie. Uh, this is uh, very confusing. We're going to try to break down for you exactly what we know about these uh, three people who were shot. Now, police say that one man who was shot near this park made his way to an apartment complex, and that is when he was taken to the hospital. Now, a second victim showed up at the hospital on his own, so police can't be sure that he is connected to this scene right here behind me. And now, Southwest Medical Center is telling K2 that a third person showed at the ho at the hospital showed up with a bullet wound as well and right around the same time. Now, our news partners at the Columbian are saying that one man was actually spotted outside the medical center bleeding in the bushes, and that is why the place went into lockdown, because people were unsure of where the shooting was coming from. Now, two of the victims we know are in their late teens or early 20s. That's according to police. Uh, what we know also is that there was a fight here at the park, and then gunshots were heard. Neighbors around here describe what they heard. We assumed it was kids messing around, but the second shot was loud enough where it scared us, and I was like, wow, you should call the cops. And Well, police are not saying at this time how bad these injuries are, but they did say that one victim cannot even communicate because his injury is so bad. Now, here at Jaggy Road Park, uh, we're hearing reports from the Columbian that police are looking for two suspects, that two people are said to have run from the scene, two men wearing hooded sweatshirts, and that's all we know about those suspects at this time. We're live in Vancouver. Valerie Hurst, K2 News.